Brexiteer Ben Habib has argued Boris Johnson must make two crucial changes to ensure Brexit Britain has a bright future outside of the European Union. Former Brexit party MEP Ben Habib argued the UK has the potential to be an international powerhouse after cutting ties with the EU. During an interview with Express.co.uk, Mr Habib claimed Boris Johnson had a responsibility to ensure the UK attracts significant international businesses' interest. Mr Habib claimed the UK must make it appealing for businesses to set up in the UK and are given the opportunity to thrive. He said, assuming we are successful in mounting a recovery from where we are, which I hope we will be, if we are able to do that the next stage is to make the UK a very business-friendly place to be. There are two crucial aspects to that. The first is to make sure the taxes that foreign entities pay when they set up in the UK are low. The regulatory environment for businesses also needs to be friendly. Again, without wishing to bang on about it, we can only really do that if we properly cut the apron strings from the EU. We can then deregulate the United Kingdom in the way we need to do it to benefit our businesses and those that wish to invest here. Mr Habib also emphasized the importance of Britons changing their spending habits to ensure a prosperous future for the UK. He claimed Britons needed to buy more British products rather than buy from European and international companies. Mr Habib said, the United Kingdom consumes far too much from abroad. People talk about the pressure the pound has been under for the last few years, it is principally because we run a very large trade deficit. This means we are buying too much from abroad than we are exporting to abroad. Mr Habib outlined what Boris Johnson's government needed to do to see this transition in the UK markets. He said, one of the ways to protect our producers at home is for the government to favour the UK when buying goods. They must also levy tariffs on selected goods coming into the UK. This will allow our producers to compete. 